There is a sister that side who's light in complexion. Come, I want us to pray for your marriage. There is a sister here. 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 Who's light in complexion? There's a sister there. Not in this group, but the following one. Come, I want us to pray for marriage. There is also this sister, you, who's standing by the pole. Come, we pray for your marriage. Yes, you, come. I want to pray for both of you for marriage. Amen. Yeah? Amen. Because now you have turned into a laughing stock. Amen. Hmm? Amen. People now ridicule you. Yes. And they say your mates are long married. What are you still doing? Hmm. Amen. Are you understanding what I'm saying? I don't understand. Are you married? No. <laughs> So I want us to pray for marriage. This thing is a curse in your family for you people not to be married. But as you break this curse, everybody else will enjoy marriage. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Come out! Come out! Come out! In Jesus' name. What are you doing to her? Eh? What are you doing to her? Why you don't want her to be married? Why you don't want her to be married? Eh? I command fire all over your body. In Jesus' name. You are free. Sister, disappointment is a thing of a past. Are you hearing me? Ceci? Hello. Disappointment. Mm. It's a thing of a past. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. You will not be disappointment again. Hallelujah. Amen. In Jesus' name. Jesus. Can you tell us your name and where you come from? Matabo Kitualimpopo. Can you tell us the prophecy you received today and also confirm it? Yeah, prophecy Bulalaka, marriage, disappointment in my family and the case of the family. What was happening? Uh in my ups and down here in the in my family. Disappointment like you so this thing I think in affect that too much. And for how long has this been going on? Yeah, disappointment. Since my childhood. And the issue of marriage? The issue of marriage, like, in Kasari Kendamu, the ups and downs. No, I felt delay, like, yeah. I think it's a delay because of Satan. And now that they've prayed for you, what is it that you believe God will do for you? So, I think God will do for you. Already will feed him because uh, everything uh, is possible to him and uh, nothing. He looked like uh, naked to him. Words of encouragement to the viewers? The words of encouragement in Gabajawa Torwaza can go disable. Wahon, no matter what. But he aren't to Yadragal Yadragal. Can I pray with you? There is, there is, there is a mama here. Who, who is very sick. There is a lady here who is sick. And doctors are saying to you, there is no more hope for you. I want you to come out and we pray for you. There is a lady here in our midst. You were sick and the doctor said there is no more hope for you. 
Please don't be ashamed of anyone. Come, let us pray, and God will heal you. Come, let us pray, and God will heal you. I'm saying it for the last time. There is a lady. You've been to the doctors, and they said there is no more help for you. Come, let us pray. God will heal you. Do you hear what I'm saying? Ma? And the doctor said there's no more hope for you. Let me pray for you. In Jesus' name. Mama, you are free. But you are not the person I'm talking about. For me, the doctor didn't tell her I don't have hope. But I went there and said, itching. Sorry? Itching, itching. At my back. Then I went to the doctor so many times. They checked. Everything is okay. Well, you said you went to the doctor and what happened? I went to the doctor. They checked my blood. Mm -hmm. Everything is normal. But there is a very big itching. Itching all. Oh, itching. Yeah, all over the body. All over your body. My head, my back, and it, it, it come on my back too much. But now it reduces a little, but it is, uh, I don't know what to do again. You, mm. Mama, is, is a spirit that mm. they have set for you not to be married. Mm. Mm? There is what? Are you hearing? Do you hear what I said? Mm -hmm. On you, it's a spirit that they have sent for you uh, not to be married and enjoy marriage. Yeah, this. Did you hear what I said? Yes, I heard. That's the spirit that they have sent to you. Mm. Mm? Yes, I heard. For you not to enjoy marriage. Mm. That's why you are feeling like this. Yes. Mm? Mm. And this thing didn't start now. No, it is now nearly seven months. But, Seven months. but before it was uh, something, and if you got any itching, you go to the doctor, they will give you some medicine. Mm -hmm. But this time, there's uh, no medicine. Mm, I go, I put medicine, no use. Yes, mm. it's because it's mm. a spirit. In Jesus' name. Place your hand on your stomach. Mama, where are your children? They are one in America, one in uh, Kuwait. In what? White, one in Kuwait, one in America. Okay. Mm. We need to pray for your children. Yes, I, brought, I came because of that. I'm coming from Kuwait. You're going from where? From Kuwait. Kuwait. Mm. Arab country. Qu where is Kuwait? Arab country, Gulf, near Dubai. Oh, okay. Mm. Let us pray for your children. Yeah. Because there is a family case that is following them. Yes. Hmm? Mm. As it of now, there is nothing progressive about your children. Mm. Yeah. Yeah? Even me also. Mm. Mm. Your children has gone to school, but there's nothing. Mm. So I want us to pray. You, you don't have to work. If your children can work, then yes. you will live to enjoy. Yes, it is true. Yeah? Mm. It's not good for you to work, because now you are forcing your whole body, your whole joints are painful because of your age. Mm. So let's pray for your children. Okay. For them to prosper, then they will take care of you. In Jesus' name. Mama, you are free. Mama, can you tell us your name and where you come from? Uh, yeah, my name is Helen. I came from Kuwait. From Gulf country. I, Gulf. Near Dubai. Yeah, I came from that country. And today you received a word of prophecy from Prophetess Tendro Simon. Can you tell us what is it that she has said to you and also confirm it? She said to me, I told her that I have an itching. 
now about uh, one month or so many, not one month, about the f six months, seven months like that, itching. I went to the doctors and uh, they check everything, they will find the blood is so normal, everything is normal, but the itching is continue. I don't know what to do. I put medicine, not working. I put the herbs, not working. Then I think that I have to come to, to, to the, I, it is a spiritual thing. I have to come to the spirit um, father to come and heal. That is why I came. And for how long has this itchiness been bothering you? Oh, maybe nearly seven months. Mm. So you said you went to the hospital. They didn't give you anything to stop the itchy. They gave. They gave so many medicines. They gave creams. They gave. Um, they gave a tablet. They gave so many things, but it will work little stop. But it is not working at all. That's another time. Mm. That is why I was thinking this is spiritually. Mm. And today the woman of God has prayed for you and also located this problem that has been troubling you for a long time. Mm. You say this is a spirit they sent to me. This is not sickness. The spirit to bother me. Mm. Not to enjoy my life or something like that. Mm. And as you have received this deliverance, as this was a spirit, do you believe that God has changed your situation today? Yes, yeah, sure, I believe, because I know that that is why I came here. It is a spiritual event. When I was there, I told them this is not, a, this is not a medically or something again, because I, it is demonic. There is a spirit behind it. Mm. And now that you are free, if you are delivered from this spirit that has been attacking your life, what are the words of encouragement would you like to give also to others that are watching? As you came here, believing that God is going to do something for you and you were located, and I believe that God indeed has done something for you. Mm. Uh, I have to tell if they have anything, let, let them come to the spiritual father here to... Because this wall belonging to two, there is a spirit, there is physically. And when you try it physically, it's not working. Better to run to the spiritually place to come and, and find it. As I was, I know in my heart, I was telling this is a spirit. It is not something. Any, because all type of medicine, the more I put medicine, the more problem. If I keep it, more problem. It means that it is a spirit. I um, thank God for uh, this um, prophecy for the, my daughter. She told him, uh, anybody who won, who has a problem, better to run first. Somebody told me to go, don't go, go to Egypt or go where. I said, no, how can I go to God? I have to go to, e to, to God and then again go to, to outside how. God is the one who created everything. I have to run to God. But that is what brought me here. Mm. She talked also about my children. I came also because of my children also. Because my children, there is no good work. When my daughter is not working, I am the one working. And they study nicely. Is my daughter study nicely, but no, it didn't work. Work is not there. Also, I know there is a spirit behind it. You know, cars or something like that. But this is why I run here. Mm. If I am happy, if anybody, I will go and carry some people also to let them come. Mm. Because the, I believe something good. I will not go without uh, with my encouragement. Then I'm happy.